uh, the axe is on top of the flag as well. It's a Scottish war axe. It has a big spiky bit and a, a bit that looks like you could chop down a tree. But very, very efficient. And, um, and it was the, the pikemen that I told you about. When we were looking at the archers, I told you about the, uh, you know, those big sort of dabbers, those um, soak up the blood things, those tassels that they had on their, on their waists. Well, the pikemen had to have those on their pikes as well because, you know, things could get pretty messy and you didn't want your pike to get slippery in your hands. These are little practical tidbits I'm giving you. <laughs> So, a big, big important battle, and 1314, this was really when, when, when Robert the Bruce, liberating Sir Stirling Castle from the English, uh, he uh, becomes the king, accepted by all. And um, then I'll tell you what happens in 1320 later. That's a very exciting story, and as I said, it has a lot of importance for Americans. It's up. No, you don't need your head, head, your head set. <laughs> you don't need your head set. Okay, we'll go in and we will drop off down there. There's supposed to be three bays down there. Okay. Okay, we see a barrier that says no entry. 